morning and welcome to or welcome back to my youtube channel today i wanted to film like a productive day in my life kind of video because it's my day off and i have no real plans but <laughs> just generally have an issue where if i don't have plans and i haven't written like a to-do list for the day i do nothing and that's how i've set myself up i've washed my hair as you can see it's curly it was so overdue like honestly i leave it way too long between washing my hair and it's just yeah i don't know i feel so much better when i've just like cleaned my hair and i just feel nice i guess um anyway <laughs> it's not the point of the video <laughs> this is gonna be a productive day in my life a spend the day with me getting stuff done kind of vibe um, but yeah, so the time right now, you can't really see it. But yeah, the time right now is like 3 p.m. I've been watching American Horror Story. I actually had to get out of my bed because I was falling asleep. <laughs> it's actually really cold, so I'm just gonna pop this blanket around me. I'm just, I'm living my life, but like, not really. <laughs> I'm really just, lazy i don't know i'm lazy and i just don't know why i try and fight it so yeah today's video is a lazy day in my life i just finished season five which is hotel i think that's season five and now i'm starting season six which is roanoke roanaki i don't know how you say it um but yeah i'll put it on the screen because i literally i don't know how to say that roanaki roanak roanoke Anyway, I started the series before and it was like a couple years ago, I think. And I only watched up to season, like episode three or four because I got scared. <laughs> I didn't want to watch anymore. So we will see how I get on with that. And I do like watching TV and watching Netflix and stuff, but I do find like it wastes my whole day. Like I have probably watched like four episodes of American Horror Story today and they're like an hour long. There's four hours of my day gone just by watching telly. Which obviously is fine because I didn't have any plans. The weather is horrible. It's like cold and like kind of raining. But at the same time, like I kind of like the weather like this. I'm really just looking forward to autumn because <laughs> I want to be like <laughs> wrapped up and cozy and like have a little hot drink. And I really want to try like all of the full drinks, like a pumpkin spice latte. You know, I'm like, I'm craving those vibes. But yeah, I thought we could just spend like a lazy day together. I feel like I really need to start planning my days off. But also, if I pack my day off with like loads of stuff to do, then I end up feeling as if I didn't really have a day off. But then I'm gonna feel like, kind of like I wasted my day today because I haven't done anything. You can't really win, like. <laughs> and also who really cares? It's just like me, like my life. I. Don't know why I feel guilty for doing nothing. Yeah. Anyway, if you're watching this because you're feeling lazy, this is your sign to just embrace it. Be lazy today. Do nothing. Chill. Hang out with me. Let's just, like, have nice chill vibes. Some days you're productive, some days you're not. It's really funny how, like, lockdown and, like, being inside all the time and everyone was, like, desperate to go out. And now that we can do whatever we want, whenever we want, I just want to stay at home all the time. <laughs> like, I don't want to go out. I mean, the weather's gross, but like, mm, the public, man. So I thought I would talk about my favourite thing at the moment, which is my prep coffee subscription. I literally, I tell everyone about it, it's like £20 a month for the first month is free. And you get unlimited coffee, basically. I mean, you get five coffees a day.
know this is like a lazy day but I do feel like going outside sometimes really does help you feel like just a little bit better and not like sluggish and lazy there's a difference between like purposefully being lazy and then also like just literally cannot be bothered to do anything which is how I was feeling <laughs> so I've got my product coffee subscription which I use like basically every day now the first month is free and so I got like a soya hot chocolate because it's pretty late it's like 4 p.m so didn't really want to have my caffeine in like this late in the day felt like I was spending so much money on coffee like the subscription is only 20 pounds there's a prep, like three prats basically near my house and then there's one right next to where I work so I thought it made sense to try it out so the first month is free so I'm currently doing that I've got this soy hot chocolate and yeah it's nice to just get out the house for a bit even if it's like just a 20 minute walk and I'm also currently listening to audiobook on my phone the Midnight Library by Matt Haig and I've read his other book which I think is called How to Stop Time I think that was like a few years ago and yeah I'm enjoying it so far I'm like halfway through and I just listen to audiobooks on like my commute to work to and from work just for something different because I listen to music like all day whilst I'm at work so it's nice to have like a change and yeah that's it just <laughs> outside home now I have got the drink I'm still drinking I literally just walked there walked home and now I'm back in the bed <laughs> it's a lazy day so it's fine to just be chilling in bed I'm just gonna watch YouTube and I think I might read a little bit of my book as well so that'd be fun I'm currently reading um, the prequel to the good girls guide to murder which is called Killjoy and it's actually a really short book I think it's like 150 pages or something maybe even just 100 and it's like set before the book that I've already read and then there is one that's like the sequel which is after which I might read next but I also want to do like the little Harry Potter series that I was talking about in my last reading vlog which has only got like 20 views but yeah <laughs> if you did not know about that I would just say planning on doing like a little Harry Potter read with me readathon kind of series slash video in September because obviously September 1st is when everyone goes to Hogwarts so I also want to go to Hogwarts <laughs> even though I'm 26 years old. It's been a long time since I've actually read the books, it's been like, I'm not even gonna guess, maybe five years, maybe longer, probably longer. So I wanted to like reread them and like do it as like a reading vlog series so yeah I thought it'd be fun obviously if you're not into Harry Potter sorry <laughs> just that I'm gonna yeah read my book watch some YouTube and then order dinner when my boyfriend finishes work because he's working right now this hot chocolate's really nice by the way I got always soy milk it's my milk choice always pick soy milk sometimes I say oat and it's never it's just never quite the same my favourite soy milk is the long life like own brand stuff, like the sweetened one. Doesn't matter which shop it's from, it always tastes so good. Like I prefer it to Alpro, but I like Alpro's like flavoured drinks and yogurts. Yeah, fun fact about me that nobody asked for. <laughs>
Okay, so it's like 10 p.m. now, and this has literally been such a day of doing nothing. <laughs> I didn't get that. Could you try? We just finished watching yesterday the film, and I did not realize like at all how much Ed Sheeran was gonna be in the film. Like, I knew it was the guy from EastEnders, like who was the main character, but yeah, Ed Sheeran was like a massive part in the film. <laughs> it was good. I'm kind of glad I didn't see it in the cinema though, because I don't know how I'd feel if I paid to watch it, kind of thing even though I pay for Netflix, you know what I mean. Nice, easy day, like, watched a lot of TV, watched a film, ate pizza. I did go outside and go for a walk, but that's about it. I think I'm actually gonna continue this vlog on my next day off, which is Sunday. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the vlog, or welcome me back to the vlog, because you haven't gone anywhere. I did, I disappeared for like five days. It's a Sunday, I'm on my way to a spin class. I haven't exercised in like, two weeks i think which is not great but i'm lazy <laughs> i can just never really be bothered to go and work out i joined a gym just so i can go to classes so i'm going to a class here we go spin i went two weeks ago it was horrible but i loved it in the end really hoping it goes well and i'm out of breath just from walking to the gym so i don't know how this is gonna go wish me luck <laughs> I've just finished my gym class. I'm so hot <laughs> and sweaty and yeah, it was tough. I'm, it's just crazy how unfit I am. I, it's really funny how like you really do lose your fitness so quick. Although it has been weeks since I last did anything, so <laughs> not that quick. So yeah, I just need to go home and shower and then I think I'm gonna start reading Harry Potter today, which will be a completely separate video, but we will see. So I just got back from the gym and I also went to the shop and I got little nice flowers for it'd be nice to myself. <laughs> so I'm gonna just put these in a little vase, vase, whatever you wanna call it, and then have a shower because I'm pretty sweaty. 